<laughs> All right, we're back and we're inside. Can't wait to get back outside to look at those cars. I know. But we have to talk about the, uh, pinhole um, gum rejuvenation. So when your gums are receding, this is what we're talking about. we got a doctor that's going to be coming in in just a couple of seconds, uh, Dr. John Chow. We're going to talk to him. So it's just an easier fix to receding gums. Right, and it about. doesn't just affect older people is what we've, we've learned. It can occur really at any age. But now with this new treatment called pinhole gum rejuvenation, they basically do it with little, no sutures, little to no recovery downtime. It's amazing. It's state of the art, really. So we have, a, we have a before picture and an after picture to show you here, too. So you can see what he's talking about. This is going to be before. And, uh, and this is one of the photos. And then the after one where he comes in and he Come corrects on. that. And apparently this is a, a very, very, very big deal. It's a and as Scott, you just mentioned, it's not just older people. It's no. also younger people. So let's bring him in now. Uh, Dr. John Chow is here. There he is. Good to see you, doctor. Thanks for joining nice Island in the you. bow tie. Yeah, Thanks for having me. All right. Goes with the good weather. <laughs> nice. All right, let's jump in right off the bat with this first question. Uh, why should people really uh, be concerned with receding gums? Good question. Receding gums are unattractive. They can also cause tooth sensitivity and may lead to other oral health issues. The aging process and health problems are also factors where receding gums, as you have said, can affect anyone at any age, even younger folks. Right. Yeah. We, we tend to think it's probably something that as we grow in age, we, it's something we have to think about. But you're obviously we're learning that it does affect people with every age. And luckily, you invented, you being the inventor extraordinaire that you are, invented pinhole gum rejuvenation. Tell us a little bit about how it works and, uh, and how you came up with it. Okay. Uh, gum, pinhole gum rejuvenation is the first minimally invasive treatment for receding gums and that requires no scalpels no sutures, and minimum downtime. Instead, the entire procedure is done through tiny pinholes made in the gums. First, the gum tissue is numbed with a local anesthetic, and then using special instruments that I designed, a trained dentist frees the gum tissue and guides the gum down to cover the exposed roots. Now, Doc, pinholes- real quick, I'm not, we're looking at some, some images here that you, that you sent us. I, I, clearly, this is an effective strategy that you're now doing. You invented it. Is it how are we talking painful? I know you're saying no sutures because that's how the other uh, process works, but this is obviously less pain for people. I'm assuming. Yeah, there's no, no, there's no cutting, and there is a tiny pinhole. There's no suturing, so that means the tissue can heal very quickly uh, on its own uh, without any surgical trauma. And, uh, and uh, the blood supply and the nerves are not really affected. And so we have very, very good results with hardly any pain and swelling at all. Man, that is something. Yeah, now, okay, I, now I'm assuming he, with, the, with the other procedures, it was painful in the past. So the question here is, you know, what, what inspired you to do this? And I'm guessing that's why, to make it a little more less, uh, you know, painful or evasive on, on the patient. Yeah, like most inventions, Pinot was developed to fulfill a need that I saw in my own patients. Why should patients sometimes have to be uh, going through so much pain and required extended recovery time, um, which is very common with grafting procedures? What's inspired me then, this inspired me then to uh, begin research and development uh, that eventually led to the pinhole technique. To date, I've trained over 3,500 dentists from across the country and around the world, and I'm continuing training courses with new online classes for for dentists. People can now find a trained pinhole dentist in most cities and towns across the U.S., wow. including Sacramento. Well, oh, that's incredible. And the fact that you are at the cutting edge, the forefront, really, of, of these trainings. So it's not really just for patients, for people with receding gums, that they're challenged with that and looking for a provider to do it. You're also speaking right to dentists, doctors who are who are doing this every day and want to be trained on how to, how to use that technique. Yes, yeah, this is information for them, too, that is available for them. And uh, they could be trained online and be able to offer this very minimally invasive procedure to treat a very common problem that they see in their practices. Oh, my gosh. Dr. John Child, thanks so much for enlightening us on that and seeing that. Uh, those pictures, man, they told a lot Woo! right there, too. Said a thousand words. Right. Boy. Looked like it could have been painful, but what he created, not painful at all. There you go. No, no, it's not. Thank you for having me. Yes, Dr. Thank you. visiting with you guys. Yes, awesome. Thanks so much. Appreciate it, Dr. Cool. Thank you. We, we got to get a bow tie like his. We must get that. 100%. There it is right there. Pinholegumrejuvenation.com uh, if you need more information.